This video will walk you through the steps of importing and adding a new attachment for your gun. For this example I've prepared the reported assault rifle. First of all we want to import our attachment we want to use. In this case we need to set up a new magazine and side socket. We need to right click one of the bones and want to create a new socket. Once that is done, name the sockets after the sockets we need. In this example it will be the side socket. Now we attach a preview mesh for that socket and set it to where we want it to be spawned. If we have added all the sockets we need, we want to open the attachment table. We are gonna create a new row for every attachment we want to be integrated. While creating a new row, we want to give it a name we can easily remember later, when we set a new attachment for a gun. The name field is how the attachment will be shown in game. We are gonna fill in the mesh we want to be shown, add the socket name where it should be spawned at and add a texture for it to be shown in game. Under the attachment modifier section you can change the attributes of a weapon with the attachment. If you want to add an extended mag, you can now change the value of the ammo in the magazine for example. The extra socket in this case is used for the reload animation, as there is an animation notifier in the reload. In the gun support section we add the index of our weapon from the weapon table. Ours is the number 7, so it can only be spawned on a newly created weapon. Can support all gun override, let us attach it to all guns. Now we do the same for the red dot. Require rack is a beauty feature if you want to assemble the weapon by attachments. If your weapon has a rack already, you can leave this on forts. In our weapon BP, we can now add the attachments. We can set the attachments we want to have the gun by default under attachments on start. Important for that is that we need the exact attachment row name, otherwise it would not spawn the attachment. Under attachment sockets, we can enter every socket that can be customized with attachments. You can see the magazine, iron sight and the cross are spawned by default, while I can choose to add the red dot sight. 